And that's the latest on Anna this morning, Jesse? Okay, thanks. Is it all right if I call you back in an hour or so? Mm -hmm. Well, I'll be in later. I'm on a three o'clock shift. Okay. All right, thanks. Bye. How is she? I want to see her really bad. Really, really bad. How is she? I know you do, honey. You want me to level with you? Yes. Okay. Now I'm going to tell you exactly what Jesse told me. There's been a slight improvement in your mother's condition over the evening. But she's still on the critical list. And that means she's very, very sick. Okay, I'm going to go get my partner. Well, Robin, wait. Right wait, wait, wait. Why? Because you can't go and see her yet. Why not? She needs me. Well, honey, she's in the CICU care unit. Do you remember what that means? Yeah, my dad told me. Yeah. Well, the people in there are very, very sick. And they have to be very careful in there not to let anybody in who has any kind of germs or a cold or anything that can cause an infection. And you know how kids are this time of year. But I promise as soon as she gets moved out of there, you'll be able to go see her. This is all for your mom's sake, okay? All right, good. Now, I'm going into work about 3 o'clock, so I'll get in there and I'll find out the minute that you can go in and see her. And what I think you have to do is think about getting back to school today. No. <laughs> Steve. Yes, Felicia. They won't let me in to see Anna. And that's right. For the time being, only family members can see her five minutes on every hour. Well, I've been taking care of Robin, and I know Anna would want to hear about her. Well, I'll tell you what. If Tony and Monica all can't, uh, we'll bend a little and change the rules, hmm? Are they around, Jesse? Do you know? Well, Monica's in surgery. Well, then I'll wait. Thanks. Scott, I need a little help here. Oh, what's going on? We're having a battle of the wills. Honey, it's really not going to be any fun to be hanging around here today. I'm about to go on a massive cleaning rampage before I go to work. I want Robin to go back to school today. Well, how can I go back to school? My mom's sick and I can't even see her. Oh, I see. That's the problem. Is she still in CICU? Well, Robin, while she's in there, I really don't think she's allowed to see anybody. I don't care. I'm staying right here until they let me in. Do you want your mother to worry about you? I don't understand. Well, what do you think she's thinking right now? None. Well, she's probably thinking that you're back in school, your life is back to normal, you're learning new things. I mean, when somebody's really sick, the last thing that they need is to worry about other things. You understand? That's true, Robin. It is. Mm -hmm. You can ask any doctor or nurse. I think I missed the school bus. Well, guess what? I'll give you a lift. Oh, well, thanks. I will get my books and my coat, and I'll be ready in two seconds. Okie okay, dokie. Okay. Thanks. I owe you one. You, uh, you look like you didn't get a lot of sleep last night. I didn't. Well, you know what? Maybe you shouldn't do all that cleaning up and... Scott, don't tell me what to do. Why are you so on edge? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to snap. Listen, when I come back, I think you and I ought to have a little talk. I think you and I have gone far enough. Oh, wait a minute. You don't even know what I want to talk about. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, Robin. We'll go. We've got to get a few things straightened out, Bobby. Come on. today. Still on the clear list. I see. Okay. Um, well, listen. Do me a favor. Get word to Scorpio. Tell him that the state commissioner of police is here and he would like to see him in his office. Commissioner Case. Uh, um, listen, one more thing. If you can, would you tell Anna that uh, all her friends down here at the police department were all thinking of her, pulling for her, and probably most of us are praying for her. Chief. Oh, hold on a second, Duke. Get word to Robert that I'm in town for a couple of days, and uh, if Anna's condition, you know what to yeah. say. Duke, uh, just tell Scorpio that the commission will be here for a couple of days, okay? Thanks. I can't take the man away from her today. He'll appreciate that. Mm -hmm. But then after that, Scorpio and I have to get uh, things squared away. I've got to tell him that Port Charles isn't a one-crime town.
I know that. But he'll have to know it too, Chief. I'm sure he does. You know, we have to remember that we got Scorpio back here in the police department because of what happened to the mother of his child. Now, the thing is, he needed us for backup, police personnel and equipment. But really, let's face it, that was the deal. I'm very willing to take it from here. I don't know what's going to happen if Anna... If Anna doesn't pull through. I mean, uh, how much can a man take? He already lost Holly the last 12 months, too. I'll pray for Anna. And then we've got to get on with other crime matters. I'm getting word from our undercover men in New York City that there may be mob activity starting up in Port Charles again. I heard that. It could be our most pressing problem here. And for it, we need a man like Robert Scorpio. But full time. Mm -hmm.